You know, my cousins have actual babies, and I have this baby. They're like, my baby can put her head up, you know, and I'm like, yeah, my baby has sexy rims. Yeah, that's not true. I don't want to conform or adjust into someone else's life. I want to make a life for myself. I'm, it's weird how I remember all this. I did this a year ago. <laughs> the first time I put on red lipstick was back in college. When I went home, I used to go straight to my grandma's room. And when I went back with the red lipstick on, I could see it on her face, the disdain, the disapproval. It's just lipstick. It's just a shade of lipstick. And it makes me feel pretty. And that's important to me. Okay. Every girl, even boys in my, in my family, they get married by... 24. Whenever someone asks my parents, you know, what are you going to do with her? You know, she's past that age. They don't have an answer to that. <laughs> and I do have an answer to that, but I usually stay quiet, you know. Bear not poke the bear. Uh, Third friend. Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. That's it is. Oh, that's it. That's so my brother is seven years younger than I am. And I told him that, you know, it's important that he learns how to cook. Okay. Hmm. I learned this like... So I'm kind of raising him as a person who's who considers that there should be equal opportunities for genders. So these are the scratches that I was uh, telling you about. So these, every time I look at them, I just get this insane rage inside me because like I told you, I worked so hard for this car. It's my first car, it's like a baby to me. And when I have to see it every time, it just reminds me of how easy it is to, you know, pull someone down like this. We found out that one of my family members who had a really big problem with me having a car because I'm a girl, had keyed my car in protest and it took them what a minute two minutes i worked for it seven years and now my car is badly scratched just scars all over it you know this has never been done in our family this giving this kind of freedom to a girl is kind of outrageous you know if i can drive i can drive around go on dates with boys according to them i could go to parties i could do anything i wanted because i had a car and then again i could get up, decide, I want to leave this place and I can get in my car, pack my bags and go wherever I want to go. So right. we just need someone who can think logically. Okay. And got has it. programming and architecture experience. Sure. I actually got a few CVs over the week. So I work well, in week. an e-commerce startup. I've never known a girl in my family okay. to work. I've never known them to be independent mm -hmm. as such. And that's fine if you want that sort of thing. But I don't want that sort of thing. I want a different life for myself and I'm working my way towards it. Driving gives me a sense of freedom. I'm more in control. I love being independent. I think it's the most real sense of having the independence that I've always worked for. Um, they're inside. Hi. I want to travel alone with friends. I plan to travel a lot one day. Or find a job somewhere and then live alone in another country, in another city where not a lot of people know me. I still have that dream. I mean, if I don't fight as hard as I do, if I don't work towards it, I'll be knocked very easily into a life that I do not want. 